The first one is the flow splitting function. The first element divides the liquid into two flows. Then the next element divides the flow again into another two flows. And the process is continued, splitting the liquid into two flows, four flows, eight flows, and so on. After passing through 18 elements, the liquid has been smoothly divided 260,000 times. The next one is the conversion function. When the direction of the flow changes along the streamlined surface of the twisted shaped element, the flow is rotated in the direction of the axis. Under this force, the fluid flowing in the center section of the pipe is moved to the peripheral section and the fluid in the peripheral part of the pipe is moved to the center section as it is pushed. That is, if viewed from the cross section of the pipe, this flow can be described as a movement that rotates in the semicircular part partitioned by the element, subsequently causing the fluid to spread out along the element, gradually thinning the layer of the mixed fluid. The third is the reversing function. Fluid that has been induced into a clockwise turning flow during its passage through the element has its flow direction reversed counterclockwise by the following element. The fluid is stirred by the turbulence of this rapid flow. It might be easily understood if you imagine a washing machine's alternating mode of operation in which the direction of agitation is reversed back and forth.